Welcome to the University of Michigan Dentistry Podcast Series, promoting oral health care worldwide. My patient today is Debbie Malkovich. She has come in for her routine oral examination and oral prophylaxis. I've completed the oral examination to the occlusal segment. I am now going to palpate the temporal mandibular joint. Would you open, please, and close. Open again. Swing your jaw to the left, to the right. I'm palpating to feel any jerking or clicking or snapping in this joint to notice any tenderness or soreness here. No. Thank you. I will now ask the patient to go into lateral excursions. Let's put this in your mouth. All right. Now. Bite your back teeth together, please. And come out on the left here. Just a little bit more. All right, go back a little bit. All right, that's fine. We're looking for the balancing and the working contacts here. You'll notice how the maxillary cuspid and the mandibular lateral fit right together. When we have the patient going to lateral excursions, we're checking for the working and the balancing contacts. We're also going to notice if the cuspids come out of contact when she makes this movement. Next, I'm going to check for wear facets on the teeth. Here you will notice the excessive wear on the mandibular anteriors. Notice the saucer effect on the mandibular left central and lateral incisors. This way. Since these bottom teeth don't seem to be hitting on the upper teeth, it seems unusual that they should be so worn. All right. Do you ever grind your teeth at night? Uh, not that I'm aware of. Do you ever bite your fingernails or chew on anything? I do bite my cuticles. Would you mind showing me how you bite your cuticles? All right. You notice the difference in the position, how her anterior teeth are in contact here. And when she's in the lateral excursion position, when the cuspid fits right into the lateral. I'm now going to check the posterior occlusal of the teeth for wear facets. I notice that you're missing your first bicuspids. Have you had any orthodontic work? Uh, yes, I did about eight years ago, and I had four teeth extracted at the time. I see. Would you mind placing these back in your mouth? All right, bite your teeth together. Can you come in closer? can notice the recession on the first molar here and the overjet on these molar teeth. The same is true of the other side. Okay, thank you. A further check of the teeth is percussion of these individual teeth. 
normal teeth with normal roots usually give a sharp click. Notice the difference in sound in this tooth. And then this tooth. When we notice such a difference, we can check further. Would you bite your back teeth together and come out laterally? All right, are they together? Go back a little bit. All right, now tap gently. Can you see the blanching of the tissue above the cu cuspid? At this point, I would like to take a look at the patient's radiographs. I would like to have an instructor check your mouth. Excuse me for just a moment, please. Okay. Dr. Ash, I've noticed mobile maxillary cuspids, abnormal facets of wear, and recession in this patient. I'd like you to take a look at her. Do you have radiographs? Yes. Does it show any root resorption? They don't show any root resorption or bone loss mm. at this point. Has the patient had orthodontic treatment? Yes, she's had a four bicuspid extraction about eight years ago. All right, we'll take a look. Thank you. I'd like to take a look at your mouth, please. Close your teeth together. Tap your teeth up and down. Move sideways, please. Back again. Way out. Do it again. Hold it right there. Tap up and down, please. Back teeth together. Come out the other way. Tap up and down. Back teeth together. Grit your teeth sideways. Again. Tap up and down. Do you clench or grind your teeth at any time that you know? Uh, not that I know of. This, uh, wear on your tooth out here on this side and over here. Have you noticed it? No, I haven't noticed mm. it. It's quite a ways out from your normal chewing pattern probably. Is there anything that you do that might account for this wear? I do bite my cuticles, but we've discovered that I do that using my front teeth. Close, please. You have any problems with your joints? No problems. No tenderness? No. Open and close. Sideways. The other way. Thank you. Dr. Ash has indicated that the reason for the tooth mobility is occlusal trauma. He has also indicated 
The reason for the abnormal wear is because the patient is bruxing. We have found no temporomandibular joint disturbances at this time. Dr. Ash has also indicated that the patient be referred to an orthodontist for treatment of the occlusal instability and the impinging overbite. Treatment for the bruxism and the tooth mobility should be considered after this. You've been listening to a presentation from the University of Michigan School of Dentistry, which is dedicated to supporting open learning and open educational resources. This recording is licensed under the Creative Commons. It may be reused and redistributed for nonprofit use. Please attribute materials to the University of Michigan School of Dentistry and redistribute under this same license. For more information on how this and other University of Michigan School of Dentistry recordings may be used, visit www.dent.umich.edu license.